I grew up in a town called Turlock, where I spent most of my years, and on one side of it, next to my house, was a chicken ranch, and then across the street were almond fields. It was a fairly simple way of, of life. There wasn't a lot to do. My dream was always to come to Los Angeles to see the big city, you know, to see the lights, to see something bigger. I got my job um, 30 years ago at Joffrey's. I started as a busboy. When you go into Joffrey's, there's this, this soul is there. It's, it's magical. It's, it's something that I have never found anywhere else. When I got the promotion from busboy to manager, it, it was like, I cannot believe. I've been six years that I've come from being a busboy to being to run, to be a manager of this restaurant all the steps, all the choices, all the decisions along the way, all the hardships. I think a lot of it comes down because whether I was a busboy or I was a waiter, I wanted to do the best of my job. I, I even valet parked, I bartended, I did the host job, anything that they needed. But it was great because all those jobs helped me be a better manager because I had an understanding for what people did and how hard their job was. He, you know, he had that experience coming up where he started off at the bottom and he worked his way to the top. Jeff has influenced me to be a better worker working at Joffrey's. He has a specific way of dealing with people, and it's very kind. And if you make mistakes, it's okay. You know, nobody's perfect, and he understands that. But we try to be the best that we can be. And as long as you do your best, I think he's happy with that. He works hard. He's driven. You know, he's a driven individual. You know, he, nothing was handed to him. Nothing was handed to me. We've had to earn everything that we've, we've gotten in life. And that I think that drive is always going to be there with him. He never is satisfied, as am I. Jeff and I developed this relationship that's, you know, second to none. We're, we're almost like brothers. My job and my teammates' job at the restaurant is to basically give people this amazing experience that they can just relax and enjoy themselves and connect with family and friends. We're different because we're smaller. We're different because we're more connected. I mean, when you watch a tree grow over 30 years, when you watch a restaurant evolve, when you see guests that come in and you've seen them year after year after year, it's home. You should walk out of Joffrey's feeling like you just escaped your life, wherever it is. And you came over to Joffrey's and spoken to the staff, the management, and you feel like you were loved. Sits on a cliff overlooking the ocean. You get the clouds rolling in, that constant sound of the surf, surrounded by gardens. It's like sitting on the cliffs of the Mediterranean. It's, it's a magical place. And I hear this all the time, and, and I feel it, and I've been there so long, and it, it makes me so happy when other people recognize that too. When I think of what Joffrey's represents, it's home.